Hi, let's solve one previous question. This question was asked in GATE CS 2021 set 1 question number 9. Consider the following array. One array is given. Which algorithm out of the following option uses the least number of comparison among the array elements to sort the above array in ascending order and four options are given. Just mark the array, it's already in ascending order and it is asking which algorithm will sort the array in ascending order with least number of comparison. Means if one array is already sorted, which algorithm time complexity will be less or which algorithm will do least number of comparison. Let's check one by one option. Option A, selection sort. In selection sort, what we do is select the minimum element and that we swap with the position. Like first minimum element, swap with the first position. Second minimum element, swap with the second position. Like this, it will continue. In worst case, best case and average case, there will be same number of comparison. Here, running time will be order of n square. No matter how data is arranged, whether it is in ascending order, descending order, or random order, there will be always same number of comparison. So time complexity is order of n square. Next is merge sort. In merge sort, we divide. Then during the merge, we'll sort it. In case of merge sort, for best case, worst case, and average case, running time will be order of n log n so whether it is in ascending order or whether it is in descending order or in random order number of comparison will be same time complexity is order of n log n next insertion sort in insertion sort what we do we compare right to left and we find appropriate position and there we'll insert. Like here, we'll compare 32 with 23. It's greater than 32, so 32 will be at its own position. Then 45, that will compare with 32. It's greater than 32, so 45 will be its own position. So here we are doing just one comparison in best case. If R is already sorted, we are doing just one comparison for every element. So best case will be order of n, while average case and worst case will be order of n square. If one array is already sorted, that is best case, for sorted array number of comparison will be n, or we can say time complexity is order of n. Next is quick sort using last element as pivot. When last element or first element is pivot, that is our worst case. And in worst case, quicksort running time is order of n square, whereas best case is n log n. So here running time will be order of n square. We found for selection sort running time is order of n square, for merge sort running time is order of n log n, for insertion sort running time is order of n, for quick sort using last element as pivot running time is order of n square. These running time are for this array. If one array is already sorted in ascending order, then these are the running time. Now list running time is for insertion sort. So we are doing list number of comparison in insertion sort. I already discussed these two sorting. Selection sort is a brute force approach. Insertion sort is a decrease and concur approach. I will discuss more sort and quick sort in divide and concur approach. Just go through that lecture. You can easily solve this question. And if this lecture is helpful for you, please like and subscribe. Thank you.